Sorry, hey, 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 let me just get, ta -da, ta -da, one moment, oh, one moment, let me get Instagram on. Okay, perfect, let's do this, beautiful people. All right, yes, 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 today I have no idea gonna, what's gonna come out of my mouth, but you know, it's gonna be great, and I'm setting the intention, it's going to inspire you, and it's gonna mm, get you to think, um, because we've got a cool topic. Hey, Courtney, how are you? Um, and of course, let me share this um, right across the group so everybody can have a piece of the action today. Um, and of course, you are, in case you're wondering, in case you don't know, this is Boss Queen TV, the Soul Abundance channel for the queens and of course the kings who are ready to truly, you know, live life on the terms because that's really what it's all about. I do believe that. <laughs> I do believe. I really do. I do believe you can have it all. You just got to have, you know, the courage to do it all, um, to call the shots, I call them the corners, to live life on your terms and to master it um, and to trust soul and all these sorts of beautiful things. So, the beautiful things. So, let me, that's share. Perfect. Let me approve that. I need to change my setting in the group because um, I want it to go through automatically. But never mind. Here we are. So boss queens on the rise. Okay, so, hello darling. So we've got a cool little question or a little thought I wanna talk about. Um, and I always say like, if you haven't watched yesterday's episode, of course, please do so. Because like, I believe for this week in particular, everything kind of just flows together. Talking about manifestation, talking about receiving, talking about, are you, are you guys back in Melbourne? I think you are, aren't you? I kind of forget because, I don't know, I think you are. Anyway, I'm back on the coast too. Um, and we talked about, you know, the feelings of it, all that sort of stuff. And then today, like, I want to talk about the fact that it's so important to not just talk the talk. Obviously, you've got to walk the walk. And that means you've got to do the do. Okay, right? Which can be a little bit confronting at times. Uh, and I totally get it. You know, like, today, I seriously have thought, I don't know, like it's it's just energetically a bit weird, you know, last two days. And I feel like there's a combination happening of I'm doing so much energy work, like seriously, you know, healing some stuff. You know, I've got my new book here too. So I'm digging deeper into the healing work with my clients. And of course, when you do energy work and when you work on yourself, it brings up stuff. And I've been crying a lot in the last two days. I feel like, oh my God, like loads of shifting, mourning, grieving. And it sounds maybe weird to the person that's not very spiritual, um, but it's all part of the process and I'm totally digging it. I'm owning it. It's fine. It's not like, oh my God, victim. No, no, no. I'm just saying it's part of the process. Now with all of this, I felt like I'm feeling like I'm not super duper, like, like I, I just can't be basically, I can't be fucked. Like putting out all this content today and thinking about all the promotion and thinking about, I was like, I just cannot really fathom the thoughts about it. You know, like I was like, Oh, I don't know. Um, yesterday and today. So I was like, okay, so I've got two choices. I can, um, I can nip myself in the butt, like kick myself in the ass and do the do anyway, or I can fully choose to not do it. And I know there's kind of like a bit of contradictory, <laughs> a little bit of a contradiction to what I'm saying. Um, but hear me out. So I, I have been spending today, particularly working on my business instead of, like, no, in my business, aka planning, and I've got all these amazing things and ideas, and I've got new, new people in my team that are waiting for things to do, I'm like, okay, um, and I could easily have said, you know what, I just don't feel like it, you know, I don't feel like going live today, I don't feel like doing this, I don't feel like creating all the extra content, I don't feel like it, you know, but that's really not going to help you <laughs> really you know um it's not going to help you and at the end of the day um, isn't my job my purpose here to serve you to inspire you to you know get you to do whatever it takes so that you get to live a life on your terms so i guess me being a bit of a sukilala as they would say a bit of a sukilala is not serving you and so i feel like i have a choice i feel like i can say you know I'm not going to force myself to it. I really don't because I don't believe in forcing yourself into anything because the energy behind forcing, as you can imagine, that's a very con like contracting energy. It's not a flowing energy. And that's going to come across and it's going to be awkward and it's going to be meh. It's going to be like meh, right? And no one wants meh, okay? 
I would say if that is the case, you just leave it. Find something else. Maybe walk away, come back, or give yourself the gift of having a bit of a break. It's all good because you have the freedom to know that you don't have to do anything. Okay, give yourself permission to walk away if that is the case. Now, on the flip side, on the flip side, I am very much about, well, sometimes I'd be a sukulala, but suck it up and do the do anyway. Because at the end of the day, it's not about you. It's about fulfilling, you know, your purpose. It's fulfilling your calling. It's like you're here to change people's world and you're here because you've got a desire. And so you've got to kind of do it anyway. Do you know what I'm saying? Hello, darling. So it's, I know it's a bit contradictory. If that, I don't know if that's the word, but I'm going with it. And I don't even know if it makes sense, <laughs> but I want to share that with you because I do believe it's really important, right? So I guess on one hand, yes, if, if it feels too false and you really, before it's going to be meh, like really meh, yeah, like naff, like, oh my God, don't do it, okay? Like, and you will know. But at, on the other hand, if you're just kind of being a little bit like, no, I'm just feeling a little bit lazy, oh, I don't know, you know, I've already done so much. It's like, mm, okay, well, you know what? Put your ass in the chair, as they say, and get the fuck on with it, okay? So that's what I'm saying. It's like, you have to weigh in. You got to find out, well, at the end of the day, I guess you want to know, you need to, you just have to answer to yourself anyway, right? And so you need to ask yourself, how do you want to feel tonight when you go to bed? Okay. And I thought today, I was like, you know what? I could easily not show up. I could easily not do the do. And by all means, it's not been one of my super duper, you know, highly productive days where I'm like super flow. Da, 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 da. It's been one of these where I'm like, no, I'm just going to take a step back and just allow myself to feel all the feels, you know, through the, the growth and the expansion and just being practicing, being kind to myself, because that's definitely something I am learning. And so I was like, I'm just going to work on my business and get all the thousand pieces of paper and ideas onto like one big map and start delegating. And then I'm like, I feel like I have more clarity. And I guess that's maybe still working. But to me, it's more like, oh, it's actually exactly what my soul needs. And so then I'm like, yeah, you know what? But I feel like I definitely do want to go and talk about it. Like I, you know, because I don't have to, but I wanted to, it's a choice. And I guess that's really what comes, what it comes down to knowing that you always have a choice at the end of the day. Don't just be the person that says, yeah, of course I'm going to do this. I'm going to do that. I'm going to change my life. I'm going to lose that weight. I'm going to make that money. I'm going to travel. And uh, 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 uh. You can't just talk the talk and by all means, don't talk the talk, especially don't be you know, don't be inauthentic, like keep it real, always love to be as transparent as I can and keeping it real. And I know that's what people really dig about me. People really honor that about me. So that's why, you know, I talk about it and, you know, even I probably feel like maybe I can be even more vulnerable. Maybe I can be even more transparent. You know, I don't know. I feel like I'm doing a good job, but I guess we can always do more, do more as in allowing yourself to be seen more, to show up more, to speak more truth and all that sort of stuff. So, right. But at the end of the day, you have a choice, right? So you can't just go and talk the talk. You got to walk the walk. And that means you got to do the do. Okay. And whatever that means for you, you need to decide that that's your choice. So, you know, maybe someone may listen to this and feel like, Oh, you know what? It's so good to know that I have this choice. It's so good to know that I don't have to do anything because if you're anything like me, right, we very much get sometimes caught up in the wanting to do a million things, right? So just remembering that you have a choice is great because, you know, it just allows you to go, oh, it's so good. You know, I can actually, if I don't really, 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 really feel like it, right? Or if I, if I feel like I have to force myself, exactly, choice is power, right? Like if you have to force yourself, that's not going to work anyway. I mean, that forced energy is not going to serve anyone. You just, I feel like it's not like you're going to do more damage, but it's like, it's going to be a waste, right? Because no one wants meh energy. <laughs> okay. So knowing that you have a choice is great because it allows you to go, okay, you know what? I can choose. And then you can go, okay, well, how do I want to feel tonight? Okay, like, okay, so am I making this about me? Like, am I just being lazy? Like, do I, is it just one of those where I just get the fuck on with it and just do it? 
then do it. And you know what else helps too? I find out when you give yourself permission to go, you know what, what if I just show up? I didn't have to do a spectacular job, but what if I just showed up anyway? Because then I'm kind of like, I'm showing, I'm committed, I'm doing the do, I'm stepping up to the plate, right? I'm doing the do, but again, there's no expectation. There's no pressure because I think the biggest thing is that we have the need of control. We need to, we want to get it right. We want to be perfect. We put a lot of pressure on ourselves. Okay. So that's what I do. That's why I'm here. Okay. And I, I find that sometimes I do that too with my workouts, right? When I'm like, oh, I don't know, I'm a bit tired. I don't know if you notice, like, I don't know, full moon kind of whacked me about really has. And so this morning I was like, I don't even, if I can't be fucked to do anything. I'm like, oh, what's going on here? That's so odd. I'm like, but that's maybe exactly what I need right now. And I thought, but okay, but I do want to work out. I do. I do. I don't. Okay. So here's the thing. I was like, I give myself permission to just go to the gym and if I just did a half ass workout, then you know what? So be it. And I ended up having a really good workout because guess what? You took the pressure away. You understood that you have choice, right? Same with this tonight. I was like, right, I'm definitely not going to feel like I'm feeling inspired to write, you know, all these bits and pieces of content and record and do this, but oh, I feel really inspired and called to have a glass of red tonight. Mm, I do feel that. <laughs> have a glass of red and just do some planning and scheming and getting, you know, all my bits and pieces on like, you know, all like a love, like brainstorming and mind mapping. I was like, cool. But I was like, I do feel like I definitely want to go and show up online because I do feel like we need to remember or we need to remind or I feel like I wanted to remind you that yes, it's very important to do the do, that you cannot just be talking that you cannot making claims and stating that you want to do all these things but not get your ass into gear okay but at the same time to understand that you always have choice right and here's the last bit of like thought i want to leave you with is what's really cool is like when you know that you remove all the pressure you remove all the expectation and you just do it like I feel really good now. Like, I feel like that was actually a really cool live stream, you know? Because I just gave myself permission to go. I knew that I wanted to talk about the, you gotta do the do, but I had no idea how this was gonna come out because I never really know. And now I'm like, okay, so even though I was a little bit like, I don't know if I can be bothered today, um, I'm moving in my butt because I've got really sore legs, by the way. Um, you know, so, you know, so even though I did it, guess what? That was really cool. And you know what? If one person got something out of that, if one person, right? See you, Kat saying thank you for the motivation. Thank you. <laughs> see, this is what I'm saying. So if like one person got something out of that, well, guess what? Then it's already worthwhile. And I guess that's really the reminder, hi Leslie, that I want to give to you that you have choice, that yes, at times you definitely, definitely have to kick your own ass and you're just going to do the do because at the end of the day, hey, you got to be prepared to do the things, as they say, that other people are not willing to do so you get to live the life that other people won't. But at the same time, you have choice and you need to tune in and go, hey, what do you actually need? Is it a moment, a time where you go, nah, before it's going to be complete rubbish or it's going to be totally forced? Fuck that. No, I'm giving myself permission to love on myself. Or is it one of those where, you know what, I give myself to, I give myself permission to just show up and whatever comes out, comes out. And even if I just do a half-assed job, fuck it, I showed up anyway. I'm doing the do. Boom. And afterwards, you might find that actually it was better than you thought. And it was really good. And now I'm feeling really happy. I'm going to have a glass of wine. I'm going to go back to uh, my mind mapping. And uh, honestly, like if you want to talk about this, if you have questions and thoughts that you want to share, hang out with me in my Facebook group. I'm putting a lot of thought, a lot of energy into really activating that Facebook group. We're growing, which is really cool. But I know that there's more love to come, more support, because I do feel like I'm super, super inspired to activate that group. So come in, find the button and come in over, continue that conversation over there. And of course, if there's anything I can help you out with, in particular, maybe kicking your butt, you know, understanding how can you navigate yourself of doing and being like, what is enough doing? What about the receiving? Because I'm all about, remember, success is not about doing more, but becoming more, receiving more. Then that's me. That's your girl. That's my jam. 
then you let me know. Send me a message, let me know what's happening in your world. And of course, you know, thanks for hanging out. Thank you for letting me be me because I feel like that's the only thing I really know how to do at this point or what I've learned to do really well is be me. And that's the greatest gift of all anyway. And I encourage everyone just to do you. Hmm. That sounds kind of naughty, doesn't it? <laughs> we could misinterpret that. Anyhow, enjoy the rest of your day, evening, obviously, wherever you are in the world. Continue the conversation or reach out to me if there's something in particular that I can do for you. And apart from that, remember, beautiful queen, it is your time to summon that soul success. Yes, yes, yes. It's already yours. Claim it. Because permission to be, do, and have it all has already been granted. Bye-bye.